Hey, what's up guys and welcome to Life on Stilts. Today I am here to do a swatch and try on for the new Fenty Beauty Gloss Bomb Creams. It's actually like this really elongated name for them. Um, we'll get into that in a second, but if you are new to Life on Stilts, welcome. I do clothing reviews and beauty reviews. If you are a returning viewer, welcome back. Thank you for watching, continuing to watch. So. I know what you're here for, so we're just gonna get right into it. I have all five shades. They are the Gloss Bomb Cream Drip mm, Color Drip Look. See, I want to talk about it, but I don't even know about it. Oh, I was right. Color Drip Lip Cream. They came out with five shades that I would say all five of them look pretty different from each other. I think that she was trying to like cover all bases and some very interesting colors. So I'm hoping that they are very pigmented and that I can work with some of these. To be honest, when I first saw the line and the colors that they were coming out with, I only thought that I would like two. But after looking at a few reviews, I was like, okay, maybe I could work with some of these other ones and then maybe like another one of the other ones. I just got it so that I could show you guys all five, but I wasn't really pressed to get to get that one. So we're going to start off with swatching them and then I will try them on. So I currently only have healing ointment. If you're on Twitter and stuff, you know this is all the rave. If you're on like skincare Twitter. If you never tried the Gloss Bomb line before from Fenty Beauty, it is one of my favorite glosses of all time. I have so many of the shades. I got last year's holiday set and I have this one's um, this year's holiday set as well. I'm doing a review for that right after. Show you them real quick. Bam. So this will be coming out soon, and then that one will be coming out right after, like the day after. Maybe the same day, we'll say. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, if you never tried them before, they are really great glosses. I think they're very hydrating. I won't say very hydrating. Well, let me not guess it, but... I like the formula and I think that the shine is really amazing. It's not sticky at all. It doesn't really cake. It's perfect and the shades are just perfect. All right, so for the Gloss Bomb Creams, they're saying that they provide luscious color, explosive shine, and nourished and fuller looking lips. So, you know, they, they're saying they got you on lock with this here thing so we're, we're gonna see we're gonna see these are $19 I got mine from Sephora but you know there are multiple websites um, that you can get it from I have them all listed down below in the description so we're gonna go in order so the first one is Mauve Vibes and I'm gonna go online real quick so that I can give you like their specific description of what these shades are supposed to be so that I can tell you whether I agree with them or not. First one we have here is Mauve Wives and they describe Mauve Wives as a rosy mauve color and I think from looking at it that's pretty accurate. I always smell because you never know. I might get a little scent. I might get a little scent. Okay, so this is Mauve Wives. Okay, so I don't know. I'm getting like bubblegum pink color. Oh God, mm -mm. no ma'am. See, this is one of the ones I knew. I wasn't sure. <laughs> so <laughs> I don't like this, but 
but I'm gonna try it again with the liner and see if it makes a difference. Cause a liner, a liner can really make or break a lip product, okay? So I knew I was gonna have to put some liners to wear some of these, but I'm showing you so you see, but no ma'am, don't like this. And it comes off so dark. It ain't dark on my lips. Okay, so I'm gonna try um, NYX's Prune Lip Liner. Okay, so obviously Prune, this is like a purplish kind of liner. I don't know if this was the best choice, but in my head, it made sense. Some people were gonna see. Okay, so this is what it looks like. I don't think it's as bad. Like, I think I could get away with wearing it. Mm, I don't know. What y'all think? Let me know in the comments if you think Mauve Wives is a yay or a nay with the liner for me. Next we have Fenty Glow. Fenty Glow is a universal rose nude. So this is the shade that I think I was the most excited about in hopes to be able to wear it with a nude liner and it be lit. This is the color. Yeah, I think I'm gonna really like this. It's like that soft, yeah, like soft pink. This is really nice. I like this one a lot. This is cute. Like I like it without a liner. And I thought it was gonna be necessary, but this is, yeah, this is the one. This is the one I already know. And you know they have the gloss for this too. So I'm sure like the Fenty Glow gloss on top of this will be like a great combination with the liner. Honey, this is nice. You did good girl, you did good. So I will say that I really do like the feel of the glosses on my lips and when I wipe them off, I don't like have any irritation. It doesn't feel dry. It doesn't feel like it's like ripping my skin off or anything. Not ripping, you know what I mean? But like flaking or anything like that. So it might be living up to the nourishing name. <clears throat> All right, so next is Honey Waffles. So Honey Waffles, I think. Yeah, I think Honey Waffles was the other shade that I was really interested in getting. So this is Honey Waffles. Very interesting, different shade. Honey Waffles is um, described as a honey butter brown. Okay, so this is the shade. A different kind of nude, like nude to me, maybe you know, because I'm darker skin, it looks like a, a very nice nude for me. So, I'm excited to try this. Okay, screen liner to me. <laughs> but, very potent color. This one, y'all. All right, I'm gonna try it with the liner. For this, I'm gonna be using the Pat McGrath Labs lip liner in Ground Control. I'm sure y'all probably peep my gut on this. Did not wipe off all the lip liner. I mean, all the lip gloss. 
So I like this. Lipsticks and these like cream kind of glosses. Sometimes less is more, like, you know, muting out the color a little bit. If it's too loud on you, then it'll make such a difference. So, I'm gonna try again. I'm gonna try again with less. This is like a definitely, I have like a summer only color. I really love the formula. Like it feels so like juicy. And it makes my lips look juicy too. Okay, this is with the liner. A little bit better. Still not a hundred percent sold, but it's not terrible. Next we have cookie jar and this is like a dark brown. They describe it as a chocolate caramel. Oh yeah, I said dark brown. I wasn't even looking at it because it's not really like, it got a little brick, brickish color to it. I think chocolate caramel is the perfect description for it and it's not really like, yeah, I don't know. It's a little bricky to me compared to honey waffles. That is, okay. I think this one's gonna be really nice on me. Chocolate cookie. <laughs> cookie jar. This is cookie jar. Fenty Beauty out here again, snatching all the coins. Okay, last we have Fruit Snacks, which is described as a berry red. This was the one that I was checking for the least. It says berry red, but it looks very red in the bottle. So hopefully, you know, that's not the case and it is berry red because I'm a little scared of this color. Oh. Hmm. All right, so. Fruit snacks. That looks very red to me. I know about berry. Okay, so. I have a little trouble with this one. The color is like transfer out to my Creating missing pieces, missing spaces. But this is the color. Okay. It's not that bad. I am very afraid of red shades. But it's not that bad. It's very like pin up. <laughs> very high shine. I really love the formula. I've said that about three times, okay? Formula is A1. $19, so a little pricey, but if you've been shopping with Fenty Beauty for a while, you should not be surprised by the price point. But it is nice. This is cute. I'm definitely ranking this higher than Mob Wives. So we got cookie jar. Yes, I keep wanting to say chocolate cookie, but I think it's because it's chocolate caramel. Cookie jar, Fenty Glow, honey waffles, fruit snacks, and then Wild Wives. Fruit snacks is the best smelling one. And very nice. I like this. That's so nice to be scared of red guys. Y'all here. So those are all the shades from the Fenty Beauty Gloss Bomb Cream Collection. 
if you like this video give it a thumbs up let me know down below in the comments which one was your favorite if you would like to see the swatch and try on of the Fenty Beauty holidays set right there for you and down below in the description as well if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet hit that subscribe button thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time